Captain. 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 Hello, everyone. How's everyone doing tonight? Great to see everyone. Happy Friday Eve. Happy Friday Eve, everyone. Great to see everyone. Hope everyone is doing well. We're going to be playing some more Super Metroid, and my hope is that we are going to complete it and stuff uh, tonight. I think we can. I kind of looked uh, ahead. It's been a while since I completed this game, but I looked ahead, and there's not too much further, especially if we go into some stream overtime. I think we should be able to complete it. Um, and so we'll have to see. We'll have to see how how uh, how we do with the uh, the uh, the the Ridley fight. That's going to probably be the biggest thing and stuff. There, I think Mother Brain and stuff. As long as we have enough life. Uh, we should be able to uh, complete that as well, too. But those are the, the two big uh, fights that we have coming up. So, yeah. So, I think that we should be able to complete it. Um, so, if if we are, um, I have kind of an idea of what I want to do for tomorrow. I don't have our pool schedule and stuff as of yet. Um, but um, that should be coming up here pretty soon. Weasel Almighty with the host. Thank you so much for that host there, Weasel Almighty. But uh, anyway and stuff, we will be streaming tomorrow night. And we will be doing um, our uh, loyalty retro game giveaway for sure. So definitely uh, a, hun uh, a ton of fun and stuff uh, as well. So, But um, anyway... Um, before I get caught up with chat, a huge thank you to Ragna, to MTG, and to Weasel Almighty for those fantastic, uh, hosts, uh, there as well, too. So let me get caught up with chat. Ragna, thank you so much for that host, and, uh, uh, thank you so much for taking care of that shout out and have a great lurk there my friend and mtg thanks so much for the host and taking care of the shout out there buddy and lego my yoda how are you doing there yoda so awesome to see you there my friend thanks for the uh, invite into your discord as well too i am in there i am all set so falls through the ceiling ow howdy captain and crew how's it going there jazzavar so awesome to see you. oh my gosh drumstick has saved the captain 207 times uh-oh and <laughs> my <laughs> the great and mighty Bator has been hailed 12 times. Oh my gosh. We just added that one and stuff here recently. <laughs> it's like I got here just in... You definitely did there, Senzoba. But how are you doing there, Jazavar and Senzoba? <laughs> Asked about Antar, then you are not worthy. If you know, you need but... <laughs> oh my gosh. So <laughs> MTG. Oh man. It's Captain Retro's greatest asset. <laughs> Bator is the captain now. But I know the secret of our precious mascot. He is Captain Retro's secret assassin. Hey, D-Man, how's it going there, buddy? This is the new captain. I'll hail the new captain. <laughs> this is the new, uh, new name of this channel, Captain B Buttro. <laughs> yes, it is. I think we should ask our studio audience. The audience has spoken. The new name of this channel is Captain Buttro. <laughs> Oh my gosh, we need an animated Batora somewhere on the screen like that monkey. Oh my gosh. Quick type this in. <laughs> Best 10 points you will ever spend. So I checked one person isn't 13 people. <laughs> I know, right there, Sinzova? You've used this since its inception. <laughs> Depends on how many beers you had. <laughs> Wanna see Batora do a keg stand? We should call it the butt chuck. You mean kegs? <laughs> I'm not drinking after that guy. <laughs> to butt brotherhood. Oh my gosh. It's their own keg MTG. What, what do you think this is? Some sleazy low rate <laughs> fraternity house? Please, this is Captain Buttro channel. <laughs> kegs for everyone. <laughs> well, we all are on a retro ship. Anyone who uses the butt command is officially assimilated into the butt brotherhood. Embrace your inner ass. Not like that and find your place. Does that mean we need to make a pixelated ass perler now <laughs> yes cap you have to make a batora perler do it now hey weasel how's it going there weasel great to see you there my friend how are you doing tonight yeah just belch <laughs> all you have left to do is beat ridley and then make your uh, way to turian 
to fight Mother Brain. Nice! I, that, that's kind of what I looked ahead. I was like, I wonder how many bosses. I didn't remember any other bosses after, um, you know, Ridley aside from uh, Mother Brain. So, and uh, Weasel Almighty, thank you so much for that uh, host. And have a great lurk there, Yoda. Have a great tip for you when you want to make your escape. Let me know if you want. Okay, awesome. No worries there, uh, Jazzavar. It sounds awesome. Really is a real fight. Mother Brain's a point. I know. We had quite a few deaths uh, last stream. That's kind of where we, we ended stream. So we're going to be picking right up at that spot. So glad to have you and glad to be here. Awesome there, uh, there Yoda and stuff. And have a great lurk there, my friend. You know what? I'm going to actually come right back. I'm going to actually... I forgot to pick, uh, get one and stuff like that too. But I'm going to get another energy drink. Just so we have... Uh, just so we can and stuff make it past this fight so i'll be right back and thank you there mtg for doing that uh, shout out as well too so i'll be right back everyone All right, I am back. I'll tell you the tip around when you beat uh, Mother Brain. All right, no worries there, uh, there Jazzavar. Sounds awesome. Captain's helping his uh, stock price. Feed that urge to stay awake in game and never natural sleep again. Monster energy equals tiredness is for the weak. Hey, come on. Jump on board there, D-Man. You, you don't have to buy these. If you do, uh, you can, but buy the stock. Full disclosure, I'm a shareholder. Company is a shareholder. Big uh, monster beverage fan and monster drink fan. Look at this, 709. And we beat it at like 10. I love how Cap embraces it with open arms. I do, I do. Red Bull and Jaeger for the way. Hey, MTG, really MTG? No way. No why? Bum, bum, bum. 
So anyway, so I'm hoping that we're going to be able to just complete this game tonight. If we do, I might do a different stream tomorrow night. The Red Bull gives you wings! <laughs> I love this music. Oh man, I love this beam. Where's this thing been on my life? What I want to know. Monsters are so full of sugar. Diabetes in a can. Um, actually, I get. I I have the uh, the absolute zero with the zero sugar. I can't drink them and stuff when I'm on the keto diet, but there's zero sugar I can. Yeah, it's yeah. Oh no, Are you kidding? The green ones have like so much in there. I I don't even. I couldn't even tell you the last time I had a green monster. Gotcha. And D-Man just found out. Call me a greenhorn noob. Never having uh, gone on a cruise. Got all the vegan drink plans. Never. It, you've never gone on a cruise there, D-Man? Oh, man. Yeah, they have unlimited uh, drink plans. Oh, my gosh. Either that or even, like, some of them have, like, ten drinks a day. Let me die. I'm bringing you back from the dead. Mass for dying? For what? It's carnival. You save a few bucks per day. Buying it ahead of time. No cruises, but it's nice. $60 per day for all you can drink cruises. We wait at least five minutes between orders. Yeah. Yeah. It's it it, it it is doable. I love it. It is really cool. For dying IRL. What? Oh. Oh, from drinking those? I've been drinking them for years. I thought you were talking about on this game. I'm like, I can't promise you anything on that Red Leaf fight. Eighteen percent gratuity as well. Nothing over twenty dollars a glass, and so no free bottles. <clears throat> yeah, exactly. There, D man. I'm gonna take one of everything. Exactly. And you know what? Sometimes there's, it's cool. They have like certain bars where they have like featured drinks. Like they had like one cruise I went on. They had like all like James Bond drinks. It was cool. It was really cool. Load everything you have against Ridley. You charge shots when you run out. Oh, absolutely there, Jazzavar. Definitely. What my friends and family told me. If you ever die, I'll kill you for that. Oh yeah, that's right. Here's my refill spot. Also, um, I will be taking a short break coming up here to, um, the wife is ordering some pizza. 
I had a, uh, a a cheat evening last night, and now it's just like with the holiday weekend. I'm just I'll get back on it on Tuesday, maybe. I don't know. My wife has just been so busy and stuff with the end of school stuff and everything else, and so I just I just told her let's just keep it easy. Something at least that she'd be able to like pick up or order like really quick and. I just have to prepare anything else. I'm just so. Cruise cap down to Mexico or Caribbean? Oh my gosh, I have been on many cruises. Um, <laughs> donuts for the more. No, I'm not. <laughs> I know, right? I could. I'd have to go out and get them and stuff too. But no, I have been. Oh my gosh, where have I been on cruises? I have been, see, I can't even concentrate on the game and stuff like that when I'm talking about this, but, um, no, I've been down to Mexico several times. My parents used to go to take us kids and stuff down on the, um, the carnival cruises and stuff for like a weekend or for a week or whatever like that, like down to Ensenada, like Catalina Ensenada and then back. Um, so I, we did that a lot as kids. That was before I was able to drink, um, but then as an adult, I think I've gone down to, I think I've done the the Mexico trip and stuff like that down to Ensenada once. I've done the uh, Mexican Riviera where you're going down to um, Cabo, uh, Mazatlan, and Puerto Vallarta. Um, we did, I did a Caribbean one and stuff too. Um, oh my gosh, where did that go? It um, went to Honduras. Um... Honduras, Belize, and uh, Cozumel, um, Cozumel, um, and then, oh man, I've done the Alaska cruise twice, then a Hawaiian cruise once, so, got some friends that live in Upper Midwest that have done a couple Disney cruises in Florida, that's about all I know off the, oh yes, I did, we did do a, um, a Disney cruise down to, um, down to Mexico. I believe I don't think we we didn't get off the ship though. My right, back cap gonna get the wife's dinner set up for uh, work tonight. Got a combination fried rice, chicken steak, and shrimp from the Chinese place. Oh, nice! I think my parents ever really mentioned it growing up. Did road trips though. So. Gotcha. Live up to your name. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Now it was it was always a family kind of reunion and stuff. So my my grandfather would. Um, try to keep like the 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 kids and grandkids and and everybody so every summer we would do a trip you know so we used to go to a dude ranch and stuff every other summer and then then the opposite ones we would do like a cruise so he would pay for the whole thing and we would just have to get ourselves there so yeah tried to get versace to go the poor retro ship caught on fire i know right Craven's some Asian too. Food is great. They're gonna hit up a buffet though. Never, never try. You know what? The unfortunate thing is those places might be like one of the, the last places to kind of open up. I mean, just, I don't know. I'm kind of like being able to handle everything. I just think like buffets and stuff like that. I'm not sure how confident people are gonna be at going back to a buffet, especially during kind of like any time during a, a pandemic, you know? I mean, a buffet sounds amazing, but like how much, like what the precautions probably need to be for, like with everything, I don't know. And again, too, some cruise lines are like requiring like proof of vaccination, I think even and stuff, maybe, I don't know. You know, they're kicking around the idea. <laughs> you need to live in Rosemead. Gamer friends do. Because they go, on, go out to Asian food every day with everything in Temple City, San Gabriel. Yeah, oh my gosh. I got a place that I love going to in Rosemead and stuff called The Stuff Sandwich. I love that place. They always have some good rotating taps and stuff. Every month is a theme of beer. You're full? Oh yes, I am full. <laughs> I'm like, what? <laughs> Oh no, now I'm not. We were talking about the buffet. I'm like, wait, how do you know I'm full? <laughs> Instagram everything they eat. Make me jealous. Yeah. 
I know. Well, well, now I have to always post and stuff like that on that beer. I got to figure out which uh, which day this weekend I've got. I get to uh, troll troll demon. That's my favorite part of the weekend now. Why not every day? Because I can't drink them every day. And I'm not gonna drink those 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 potent ones and everything else too. I'm gonna I'm gonna have like one a week if the the weather cooperates. Because ev most everything that I have is um is like porters and stouts. So Versace, oh my gosh, Versace saw the comment. Hey, big beefcake, how are you doing there, my friend? Have a good look there, buddy. Doom, doom, doom. You have some in the bot. How did you manage to do that? At least he and Hazy IPA today. Not too exciting. I got a backlog to drink up now since I've stocked up on a lot of ciders and lemonades lately. Still more at Aldi. Haven't had, but through most of the cheap stuff now. Nice. Elysian is a good one. I'm not sure if I had their Hazy IPA though. But, uh, <laughs> you, yeah, we did bring up the Disney Cruise. We did. A stick against the mass. Uh oh, <laughs> we got the riddle fight. But um, yeah, that that sounds awesome there, Demon. I I gotta see if I I tried the hazy uh, Elysian IPA. I'd be drinking on stream right now, if um if it wasn't for these tough fights coming up on stream here. <laughs> I smell smoke. I know, right? Well, where there's smoke, probably fire. Drunken Rune Challenge. Oh my gosh, I know, right? Definitely love the cruise activities like skydiving and surfing sim. Of course, I'd be ordering another drink every five minutes to get my 300. I know, right? That that would be me too there, D-Man. Anytime I've had like any any unlimited, um, you know, that has always been my uh, my case there too. Man. Seriously, considering getting a Quest 2 for $300 since the Series X still evades me. There's strong pro Switch rumors. I'm still using it. I know, right? So many, so many things that we gotta buy, right? You know what? The Space Pirate guys and stuff here, they come back, right? 
it's not like I could just take them out and then and then go back and save and then they're not going to be there, right? I dive on a cruise ship now because it won't let, you, won't let you board on land. Yeah, I know, right? So they do, they do come back, right? Okay, all right. That's that's what I thought. So it's kind of a moot point on trying to take them out. I mean, it's not that tough. It's just like if it, if I could like make things easier, you know, you know, or quicker on having to come back. So. Not too bad. Real sky, I think I'd have a heart attack before I even started the free fall. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? No. I'm not sure if I could do it. I don't know why in the world I would I would jump out of a perfectly good plane, you know? For my gaming laptop getting along in the tooth, I could use a couple more pairs of quality headphones, not the AirPods Max. You can't even turn turn off though. Narama has some good sales sometimes. Which tech too little time. I, I love my uh my AirPods uh, Max though. They're they're pretty amazing. Analog pocket. Yes, don't forget the analog pocket. Oh. Gotcha. You forget I know me too. I keep I keep hoping I'll get that that email soon. See, my natural instinct is to is to, to hit him, but then he doesn't uh, and he doesn't have his uh, his weak point. I love these these uh, refill spots. These things are always so great. So I think uh, 25 minutes uh, is about when the pizza is going to be in here. Gamer, how's it going there, buddy? And Dark Desta, how's it going there, my friend? Awesome to see you there, buddy. How's it going there, Gamer? Awesome to see you there, buddy. Hey, Gamer, are you going to be around tomorrow night? Or are you uh, bowling? Gotta see this. Oh no. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. Oh my gosh, that is amazing. Those are cool. I think we. Oh man. Almost have like a, a recycle truck kind of like that one. Those are awesome. You know, G Fuel made a flavor based on resiny. Did they really? Oh my gosh. That is so cool there, Dark Desta. Oh my gosh, I did not know that. Huh. 
Gotta have the best kind of drink when you're playing the game, huh? So he thought of Sam. Aw, you know what? He is not even... You know, like today, they were backfilling um, the... Uh, um, the, the um, they, they were backfilling the trenches uh, today and stuff in our backyard. Um, and, you know, they had a skit steer in the backyard. He wasn't even that interested. So he, he barely even acknowledges trash trucks and stuff really anymore. It's crazy. He's like all in on dinosaurs. Like, he knows construction vehicles, but he's not, like, all about it anymore. But, uh, yeah, if you're if you're able to make it and stuff there, gamer, and everything else, if we complete this game, I I think you should be, if you can make it back tomorrow night, you'll be, you'll, you'll be happy. It's called Maiden's Blood, really? You know what? I remember they came out with a beer and stuff. It was, um... Three philosophers came out with a beer for uh, Game of Thrones um, and everything, too. They change interests like we change our... Uh, I know, right? You you will be you be here? Okay, all right. No plans tomorrow, actually. Okay, cool. Gamer, if we complete this game, I might need you tomorrow. Because uh, we, we, we might be doing something. I'm hoping we just complete this game tonight. We just have some some tough bosses. with the host thank you so much for that host sir Fritz oh shoot oh did we get him oh my gosh Fritz you are my good luck charm look at that oh I think we're gonna for sure beat this game tonight then oh man let's see let me let me catch up. It looks like I was getting some. Let's see. Just reinstalled my Windows today, so the PC's uh, so much quicker now. Crashing quite a bit. Oh my gosh, there game. I'm glad you got that uh, that fixed. Epic Store uh, Game Store free game at the moment is Among Us. Is it really their Dark Desta? Awesome. Problem cap. Thank you, there gamer. Charge shots. Super missile. I think the regular missiles do much of anything. Gotcha. The charge shots. Good damage in with the plasma beam. If you're using the plasma beam, you have a code for Killer Queen Black for Xbox. Anyone wants to trade, possibly. 
It's on Game Pass, so oh, gotcha. Not even thousand gamer score yet, Cap. Worse than I thought. Oh man, you know what? I was almost gonna play last night. I I I swear, last night I was like so tired out. So anyway. <laughs> I have a story. I, I feel like we're going to definitely get through this, so I don't have to worry too much on timing now that we beat this uh, part. But um, anyway, so our um, we, we were we uh, had to cut locks yesterday and stuff at our storage property, and so um, we uh, we use a grinder to cut cut off the locks. You know, the people that just don't pay on their storage. We try to work out everything we possibly can and stuff with them, but if can't get a hold of them and everything else like that. We got to go through the process. So anyway, so we we're cutting the locks. Our grinder was starting to go out on it. It was starting to get sluggish, and the blades that we had were starting to crack um, every time that we used it. So um, you know, we could have went out and go, went out and bought another one, but then we would had to had to have like uh, one that was ready to go and charged, and we wanted to be able to finish everything. So I was out there and stuff like that with bolt cutters cutting like a bunch of these locks and oh my gosh i was so tired the last time i probably cut a lock was like 10 years ago um and so by the time i got home i was like oh my gosh okay all right so i told my wife let's order some pizza i was drinking beer and i was just watching movies um i i just i would have like worked on my gamer score last night but i'm like there's no way i was just i was like beat i needed like a night to just like veg and that's what i did last night so i felt kind of bad that i didn't and get more progress done and stuff on my gamer score. I think I'm going to be, ha I'll be happy with 5,000. If I can get 5,000 gamer score by, by Monday, I'll be happy. But if not Monday, if not 5,000, 5,000 to 6,000, I would be absolutely happy. I mean, 10,000 is going to be way out of reach with my amount of time I'll have. So, but thank you so much again for the, uh, for that uh, host there, Fritz and uh, gamer for doing that shout out. So, phew, I know. The e Wait, there's an e-tank in the next room? Oh, cool. Auction time. Can I buy a lock? You could. Isn't cool enough for storage wars. Yeah. You need a, you need a break. I know. That's how I was. We, we do post our auctions online. We do. We do. So, and technically anybody around the, around the world could, uh, could, uh, bid. I see a bundle is 47, uh, percent taller than the normal G Fuel and comes with a 20, 240, 24 ounce shaker oh my gosh wow you know i'll search for a few that might uh, still be in uh, game points in only 30 minutes or less with the video guy yeah absolutely yeah that that sounds awesome there gamer definitely pass that along because i've been doing like all the the short games i mean uh probably one of the best ones with was uh, edith finch i mean literally and stuff like that short two three hour game you know, and, um, you know, to get the thousand points, I did get only 900 out of that. I got to go back and get that because I missed one thing at the beginning. Now I had to re start it all over. So play a bunch of short games or, um, or easy games for quick score. Gotcha. Um, not like it's platinum hundred percent. Yeah. Short games are easy games for quick score. Yeah, I just I I just want to be able to get those points. I am I'm just like crazy for points. Right, I think wasn't there. Ooh, there it is. Got it. Nice. Normal serving for a G Fuel is around 30. Bundle is uh, 60 serve. Oh my gosh, wow. Okay, so there's not anything else in this room then, it looks like. Which way to go back to? It's been such a long time since I've played through this game. I did get the E-Tank. I did. Absolutely did. I was getting dinner. I, mean, I got tons of dupes I could... Oh yeah, that's right. That's true. I should have just... I should have just said that. Yeah, D-Man's... D-Man's got like a, a whole list going just about... 
I have Steam stuff. Oh yeah, that's that's true too. Well, I mean, uh, Rug was just talking about his uh, PC, so. Back to the ship. Gotcha. Thank you there, Jazavar. Bundle is matching Lady Drew's proportion. Is it really? Oh my gosh. That is so cool. This night. Yeah, I know. Oh my gosh. Exactly. You can. I mean, that, that game has, like, gotten so much attention. I want to get missiles, but okay, here we go. Resident Evil. It, it, yeah, absolutely. Exact. I mean, even spooky and stuff like that. You saw her picture and stuff in the Discord. Did like a cosplay of it. I thought she nailed it. Go back to your ship. Re oh, yeah, that's right. Why am I? Thank you. I'm just going to save a boatload of time. I'm like, why in the world am I worrying about this? Restock up on everything. It's not like I'm going to probably be using them. That's common when you're missing health, I noticed. Yeah. Do I? Can I? Can I leave this room or do I have to be fight these guys? Yeah, oh, okay, we can, okay. All right, I wasn't sure if this other door was locked or not. Way to find out, true. There we go. A breathe easier when we get to the safe spot. Using all 16 bits in that mode 7. Exactly. I know, right? Is it is this one 16 or is it 24? I know some like games were like 24 for the Super Nintendo. Feels so much better now that we got to got to that area. Gotta exit. I know, I keep saying 16-bit and stuff on my end, too. Like, I'm kind of wondering, I'm like, is it 16 or is it 24 for this, uh, this game? There were some of them and stuff like that that were even up to, like, 24, I think, right?
Wait, how do I get out of here now? Maybe I have to go the other way, right? Get to call it a night. Some info. The music for Super Metroid was uh, composed by Kenji Yamamoto and Kanako Homano uh, 4 and used the 16 bit versions of music from previous games. Super NES Sound Hardware allowed the playback of samples simultaneously on eight channels to the PSG channels and one noise channel at the end. Oh, cool! Thank you for sharing there, Dark Death. And please have a fantastic evening there, my friend. We'll be back on tomorrow, too. If you're able to uh, to join us. We also have the retro game giveaway too. Oh, this is right. How? Get past. Okay, so now do we have to, uh, I take it, I guess that we have to, wait. Oh, fake wall, that's right. I was like, oh my gosh, okay. Like, we're stuck. Oh man, we haven't even been in this room, nice. I'm like wondering how we were going to get back out. I wonder if we go this way, if we can get... Ooh! Nice! I could have gotten that before, too. Then some extra missiles that we could... Okay. Alright, so it's here. Wait, what? Get over that way, so I'm gonna miss out on that. Whatever is over that way, too. Spring ball. Okay, gotcha. And yeah, we didn't get this.
like too quiet. Okay. There. All right. How it is. Okay. Back up to Brinstar. We did, but how have you been doing there, Senzova? So great to see you there, my friend. have the auto tank but yeah at least we don't have to worry about fighting uh Ridley again Should be burnt. Okay, cool. Show how's the night going? It is going great there, Tybalt. How are you doing there, my friend? Missed you, um, it missed you on uh, stream the other day. Hope you have been doing well. Hope your week has been going well. Streaming tonight and tomorrow night, though. So, yeah, we streamed Monday and then, um, a couple days and stuff like that there off, spending time with the family and everything, so... But we're also doing our retro game giveaway tomorrow, too. The stream you don't want to miss. busy hope uh hop on for tomorrow's stream family have had a good weekend yeah absolutely yeah my wife's counting down the days she teaches fifth grade so it's been obviously a rough year yeah here in southern california we've been on hybrid so hybrid is just it's like so much more work it's almost like you're 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 doing double the work pretty much it's just it's just been tough i think every every teacher is looking forward to summer i think you know get a chance to uh you know just reset get a break and hopefully 
you know, hope, hopefully it's, uh, you know, just normal um, for fall. Oh, it's just, I think it's just been wearing on everybody, you know, so it was funny. I keep joking around with my wife. I'm like, you know what? We need like a support group for like the, uh, the, the, the husbands of teachers, you know, so it's just it's just funny. Because I think, you know, for for any any family and stuff like that, you know, usually a lot of times and stuff, if the wife is kind of stressed, you know, the the husbands kind of, you know, feel a bit of it too, you know? Yeah, come on. What? What happened? Go and reset that then. I think. Yeah. Hybrid teaching is really rough. Almost became a teacher when into sales. Made the wrong call. <laughs> no, I mean, that sounds great. I know. You know what? I, I work for uh, in property management and stuff too. But there's been there's been some areas and stuff like that with sales. Actually, well, technically I work... Um... Uh, it's time. Just... Oh, you are the best, mommy. Sorry. You are the best. All right, I'll be out there in just a few minutes, okay? But uh, yeah, with, with with sales and everything else like that, yeah. So a company I work for and stuff, and what I do is uh, manage uh, two self storage properties. So I know how the the sales part of things can go. You know, oh my gosh. Trims like all of that there. Maybe I should just go the other way. Wait. What I have to do is just make it up to that one door. Maybe I'll try not to, to do this ninja jump here. But how are you doing there, my fault? So great to see you there, my fault. How have you been doing? Cut that part off. I think that's gonna be a problem for us. Turn off that base jump. Oh no, wait. Not the space jump. What? It's got to be that screw attack then. Yeah, there we go. All right. As soon as I get past, get up to this part. Maybe once I get up to the ship and stuff, I'm gonna take um, the quick dinner break, um, and then I will be uh, I'll be back on here, and then we'll get through the rest of the game. Do it again. I would take the money I spent on college and the storage unit business, and just uh, run that. <laughs> It is really an amazing, amazing industry. I've been, um, I've been in the industry and stuff like that for pretty much twenty years with our company. So, but man, it, it is just, it's just, it's, it's amazing and stuff like that. How, you know, how much interest there is in in everything now. You know, people just realizing, and I mean, I don't want to say that we're recession proof, but it is. Um, I, th I think a lot of people and stuff like that are seeing the uh, seeing the value and stuff in in uh, in storage. So good uh, pu pupper sitting this week. Oh, nice, awesome, awesome, awesome. So yeah, so if you ever want to talk anything about uh, storage and stuff too, I pretty much that and. Uh, that and the stock market and stuff is mainly what uh, what I do, managing a stock portfolio. So that's my uh, kind of two separate things. Sometimes it feels like two 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 different jobs, you know, that you're kind of doing. You know, one is one, one is really people. Well, not really people heavy, but you know, just making sure that everything's going well on a corporate level, and then the other 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 part is you know just kind of doing my own thing and making sure double checking and stuff checking up on our companies that we have in that stock portfolio and identifying any 
kind of threats and things like that too but yeah on the sales side and stuff you know i you know you know you're you're pretty much a salesperson and stuff like that when you're trying getting giving people all the information on rent and self storage so you know business has almost zero liability little overhead and only a few it really is i mean we have three we have three storage employees that manage you know two two make two two main um employees and then uh, an area manager and they pretty much run two stores for us um and uh 1500 units so it's amazing we're, we're also in apartments as well too but you know i mean we're probably at uh about between two and three hundred uh apartment units so it's just and, and and we have a lot more people and stuff running that side at least twice as many people doing that so if you had like 1500 apartment units to manage that would be a heck of a crew of people you would need so but yeah so that's kind of more my my specialty i mean i our company has apartments but that's not i i know of it and stuff like that obviously and stuff and hearing a lot of the information got my real estate license and pilot's license but that's not what i do on a regular basis so just stormed like here in uh, Oklahoma City area, so networks being a bit meh. Ah, sorry to hear that. There, my fault. So where is this next uh, area? Definitely save. Oh man, to check on the wife, be back in a bit. All right, no worries there, uh, Jasper. Actually, I'm gonna take a really quick dinner break, everybody. So if you wanted to go get a bite to eat or a drink, use the restroom, right now would probably be the best time. Gonna have probably a couple pieces of pizza and stuff here, and then we'll be right back as well. We should have enough time to complete this game um, tonight too. So that is my goal. So I will be right back as soon as I can and stuff, everybody. But uh, just sit tight, enjoy those grog tokens that you're uh, racking up and stuff right now too, and I will be right back as soon as I can.
All right, I am back. Oh, man. Turian is on the way to Brinstar, like uh, you went at the beginning, except that you go to the right when you hit the bottom of the vertical corridor. Ah, uh, okay. You see. 1500. The, the normal occupancy percent you kid right now we're in the we're in the night we're we're doing rate increases we're doing um we're we're, we're having auctions almost like on a, on a monthly basis and we're at low 90 percent still even <clears throat> the sales explain the different options you have exactly there tybalt exactly and providing a good service too joy dinner thank you so much there tybalt oh man it was so good we got a white claw nice Got some uh, hard seltzers a few months back. I just got uh, hard seltzer lemonades, like them even more. Oh, nice! Needs alcohol. Oh man, Jazzavar. Always more booze calling my name. I tried to tell myself I save money by making mixed uh, six packs of Trader Joe's and Total Wine to try uh, one of everything instead of four to six every every of everything. Yeah, I mean that's true there, D man. Definitely. And Kimono Dragon, how are you doing there, my friend? Okay, so, um, oh man, so you're talking about on the way, Turian is on the way to Brinstar like you went at the beginning, except that you go to the right when you hit the bottom of the vertical corridor. Go to the right. Okay. You see, so do we make you went at the beginning? So it's got, like we started going this way, but how are you doing there, Kimono Dragon? So it's this way. My case manager quit, and I have to see a new one installing a Windows update right now. Oh man, sounds uh, sounds like you've been busy. But this is the vertical. Maybe here? Okay. If this is a... This is it. Wait. Hmm. Not that, that corridor I was thinking of. Okay, so this one's not it. Okay, so is it... Up here, one, uh, one further. I will, man. I really want to crack open, uh, crack open a craft beer and stuff too. But um, we still got the mother brain fight. Out of case manager won't be able to get the services I need, like job training and uh, living skills help. Aw, hope they can get that uh, for you and stuff pretty soon. So this one then, probably. I've. Uh, uh, part. Go here and save. Oh wait, it's not here. Oh, we keep going. Okay. Really see a new one next month. That's good. That is awesome. Down over this way then, huh? Forever since I've gone through and gone through this area. And a pizza. I had oh man. I let my wife pick everything this time. Normally I am like a three meat guy or like um ultimate. And um I uh I let her pick 
and um, we picked a uh, she picked a uh, Hawaiian. So your wife in the state testing. You know what? I'm not sure if they. I think they did it differently and stuff um, this year. I'm not sure on the whole state testing on it right here. Okay. Crazy and stuff. We never actually went back over this way, I guess. So, I come to hang out with you, Cap. We're getting three pizzas. Oh man, three three pizzas, three pizzas or three three meat pizza. Ultimate meat lovers, swine. Oh, we're getting three of them. <laughs> I know. I know. Not everybody is like a fan of uh, of, of uh, Hawaiian and stuff too, but. Um, I, I love like just like put everything on it and stuff too. At least at least a meat pizza and so I mean I would eat a pepperoni, but a cheese is almost a waste. Waste Hawaiian and barbecue chicken. You know what? Bar My wife is a huge fan of barbecue chicken pizza. We just um, it was funny. We we got like more a specialty pizza from a place called Hungry Howie's around here, and so they they make like a um, they, they what was it that we got last night? It was like a uh, a cheeseburger pizza one or something she it was it was it was pretty good um and they do like the the special crust and everything tonight we just did little caesars because samuel wanted uh the breadsticks he loves the breadsticks from there so my wife's like uh we should get him something something sometime this weekend i'm like yeah i'm streaming tonight just go ahead and get the pizza and so she ended up getting that and everything plus it was you know, just a lot of different things going on. It just made sense. So we ended up doing that. But I refuse to get, like, the regular pizzas that they have. I'm like, if we're getting Little Caesars, we're getting the deep dish. So normally I would get the ultimate and everything else or, like, Supreme. But, um, you know, and so, but, but yeah, cheese is almost like a waste. So <laughs> we're going to get pizza, booze, and... <laughs> and have a hell of, i know right but yeah i so they didn't have like a really a barbecue chicken pizza but that would normally be one that we would we would at least consider their tie ball cauliflower pizza is not legit oh man i know right it's just like if i i was gonna get a pizza and stuff tonight gotta get a gotta get a gotta get a good one and stuff Recon, how's it going there buddy cheeseburger pizza rock i know i i forget it's it was like i think it was like a cheeseburger bacon pizza or so I, I gotta check in with my wife and stuff on what what was on it and stuff too there's a couple good uh good toppings so oh man <laughs> yeah deep dish all i know right i just i am not a fan of little caesar's regular pizzas uh, but I think they're de it was so funny because I almost swore off like Little Caesars. I'm like, I refuse. I'm like, if you're going to get a pizza, get a good pizza. But I tried their deep dish and stuff, and I'm like, okay, all right. They're at least accommodating people that like pizza. You know, I just, the it, when you always think of like, you know, Little Caesars, I'm always thinking of like, you know, like, you know, the kids' parties pizza and stuff. You know, you're just like spending five bucks. It's hot and ready, and it's just like, come and pick it up. I was like, ah. Eh. Oh, you have not uh, had Hungry Howie's for years. Miss it. Yeah, they got one around here, so. Oh, man. Knew there was a reason I followed this channel. <laughs> Barbecue chicken, uh, meat lovers, Hawaiian pizza. When we, Yeah, I, I, I would agree with that. I mean, we could skip the Supreme one, but meat lovers definitely. Bacon, uh, cheeseburger, pizza, Domino's. Oh, had it. They had it for a while. They may still. That's just a kid's birthday party. Little Caesars is king. Yeah, I, I don't know. They, they always have it and stuff like that. Like little kids parties. And I'm like, eh. Only time I got uh, cheese pizza was at Cos Costco. Me, you know what? Costco and stuff like that's got some good pizzas. They do. I, I, I yeah, I will say that. I, I miss the heck out of that. Haven't uh, had that in a while. Won't eat the supreme pizza. Too much stuff going on. Not a fan of mu oh, not a fan of mushrooms or olives. Gotcha. Yeah, my wife neither. I mean, I think olives she's okay with, but mushrooms she's not. So I knew she wasn't gonna go for that. So it's either gonna be the meat lovers or the the Hawaiian. And I was like, yeah, I, I let her pick. Oh, so I, I technically kind of picked out the pizza last night. I, I let her uh, let her pick this time. Oh. So. Yeah, definitely don't forget to save, for sure. I was like, save spot? Definitely. For cheese or you'd prefer cheese over pepperoni? Oh, man. Cheese is just, like, so, like, plain. Man, like olives. I know, I do, too. There we go. 
like round table pizza so expensive miss the eight dollar i know right there tie ball i i forget if i had the eight dollar lunch buffet but round table was always pretty good i'm playing cheese pizza i put lots of hot sauce yeah it has to be doubled you know what i would definitely do that too i'm like i i need i want it to be different cheese is your favorite pizza and then bacon bacon and shrimp oh my gosh that sounds amazing bacon and shrimp or the merrier for the toppings for the demon mushrooms are not necessary to me pretty much any meat or veggie i want yeah i just i love being able to you know put a ton of things on them able to take them out or do i i probably have to use a missile don't i oh no wait wait how do i get them oh man good pizza is really good yeah some good pizza and bad pizza most plain pepperoni is awful Never had shrimp on pizza. There's a place around here that does it. Think uh need to do that someday before I go back to work soon. Yeah, definitely there, Jazavar. Go oh, Metroids, freeze them and then miss Oh, okay. Gotcha. By itself is bland and boring. I know, right? Didn't know shrimp pizza was a thing. I know, right? The ice beam to freeze them, then use the missiles. Super missile drop uh a frozen Metroid instantly. Gotcha, okay. already oh nice not a lot of companies do it though yeah i almost have to go to a specialty pizza anchovies on their pizza before so you know what i actually like it i do i do that was that was one thing my grandfather and i and stuff had like in common like if we would go out to uh a specialty pizza place we'd usually go to it's it's funny it's funny talking about you know work again and stuff like that too um but usually if we would go to uh, a shareholder meeting, like we used to be shareholders in Qualcomm, really good company, really good. We just had like a huge position and when they were gonna be, when it looked like they were gonna be bought out and stuff by private equity and stuff or bought by Broadcom, we were concerned. And so we um, we were starting to kind of pair back and then we sold out of our position just because we didn't want a huge tax bill at that point. But anyway, and stuff. So, so we used to go down there for the shareholder meetings and go and spend the night. So we go to this pizza place. It was called Pizza Nova and stuff. And it's one of the things that we would do is since he was there, he would get, uh, he would want bait and stuff on his pizza. So I'd be like, okay, cool. I'll share you a pizza with bait on it. And it was, it was pretty good. I, I, I like it. I actually like bait. So a crawfish pizza also. It's a bit pricey. Gotcha. Actually, like anchovies on pizza. Fire taste. It really is. It gives a lot of flavor. Never tried craw a crawfish pizza. Sounds good. Pop Papa Mur. I don't think I've ever heard of Papa Murphy's. But yeah, anchovies and stuff are good. So it was just always kind of the thing, and it was only like he and I that really liked them. I think my dad may have actually liked it, but. Um, you know, and would, would like go for it, but the nice thing is, is like it would be like he or I and stuff were the only ones finishing that pizza. So it's kind of, it's kind of like when you're a kid, you know, it's like you don't want anybody to eat your pizza, so like you lick it, <laughs> and you're like, and they're like, ew, no, I don't want that pizza piece now, you know. So it's kind of like the thing. Favorite type of pizza? Oh my gosh, I've had like lots of different pizza. One of my probably favorites is from this gourmet pizza shop place. Um, and they have one that is like um, in and out burger on a pizza. They have some specialty ones. They have like biscuits and gravy on a pizza. They they got some really cool ones. Gosh. Get this guy off of me. Oh man. Banana peppers on pizza. Yes, they are there, Jazavar. Definitely. Papa Murphy's is great. Love the take and... Oh, really? Okay, Papa... Okay, so they're a specialty place then. Yeah, they have this take and bake and stuff. This gourmet pizza shop that's really good. Place that you can buy pizza and you bake it and take it. That, that's one thing this place does. They, they both do it like... You get the pizza there and then you could also do a take and bake too. We actually did that probably like three weeks ago, a month ago. When I went to go pick up that specialty beer that I keep... Um, keep uh, uh, you know trolling uh, D-Man with 
Never worked for me as a kid. Would still eat it. <laughs> Jazz of art. Jazz of art is like, I don't care. Is it a deep dish? Yeah, deep dish is always good. Miss having dis Detroit's style pizza. I know, right there at Bubba. And how are you doing tonight there at Bubba? A friend likes anchovies on pizza and got some to put on it. I was like, you only live once and tried it and it was good. It really is. It's it's an interesting texture, but it like it gives like some some good flavor and everything to it. I think it's a really good mix. If you get a good pizza and you put some anchovies on it, it's good. Seeks a way to check on the wife. Alright there, Jazz. We'll see you when you get back. Oh, you have two hungry howies here where you live. Oh really? Nice. I know we've got one that's really close by. It's probably one of my favorite close, like, um, pizza places where you can get the pizza and stuff pretty quick that's not, like, you know, like, too specialty, you know? So, there's just, there's a lot of options by where we're at. Oh, no. Oh, what do I do? Hungry how is this all over? Is it? It's all over Florida? Oh man, do good. So glad we uh, got along. I know, me too there, Aunt Bubba. Definitely. Ever eaten at Woodstock Pizza? Normally in college towns. I don't think I've heard of Woodstock Pizza. Or to having to go back into the office next month, really like I know, right there, Aunt Bubba, definitely. Wait, bomb it. So just regular bomb then. Which sucks. Don't they have sourdough crust? Come on. What in the heck is going on here? Super bomb it. There we go. We got him. We took a lot of, a lot of hits there. Hopefully there's an area where we can refill on life and everything else. Oh man, you have the option to get wheat crust, it's really good. Don't feel like eating half, half a pizza. Oh nice! Oh man. Oh man, not again! Well, at least we got all of them at the same time there. It had wood socks or hungry howies. Gotcha. Uh, the sourdough crust because they do uh, wheat. Love that place. Check to see if there's uh, one in Il Illinois. Did uh, did you find one? There, recon. What the heck? I put those guys. The white cat kisses and was promptly told to go away after I. <laughs> Jazzavar. I think Woodstocks is only. Oh, it's only in California. Okay. I don't think I've seen one. A fun part. Kill those cat, run away from them. Gotcha. I was like, what is going on with these guys? Like, end game, I'm like so like. Lost, kind of. Gosh, what the heck? No! Uh oh, and a calcium. Definitely, those are definitely good. I got to take all my energy.
That's my Metroid. The baby Metroid. Don't strumbly do sauce cheese combos. Oh man, that sounds amazing. I already hate dinner, and I'm and you're making me hungry again. So much a baby anymore. Yeah. All right. Fruit. Life to the left. Safe. So let's see if we can hang on to everything up to that safe spot. Most of it. Nice. Oh man, I'm I'm super excited that we're gonna be able to complete this tonight. I was like, I looked it up ahead of time, and I'm like, I'm pretty sure there's not too much left. And uh, I was right. I was like, okay, cool. Yes, yeah, we're beating it tonight. Yeah, please, Cap, try and angle your shots upward at the final boss. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're pretty much like almost it. Yeah, I remember Mother Brain. Pretty, uh, pretty memorable. Dip after you beat the boss. Ape is another hard thing. Your first time. Yeah, it's. I've I played this game before. I've beaten it twice. I've beaten it once off stream, once on stream, my very first time, and then um, once um, off stream on my 3DS. So this would be my third time playing it. Favorite, my favorite type of seafood. Um, I'm, I'm almost a fan of like almost like any kind of seafood and stuff too. I'm, 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 I'm like, I'm like you there, Tybalt. Like, you know, wanting to try, try things like, uh, you know, once. Beat Resident Evil 8 and it's better than I thought. That is awesome! Or you leave the large room, try the escape, and start your speed run. Press down to store your boost for once you break through the wall. Move to the far right wall and boost straight up. Save a ton of time, not necessary, but cool time saver. Oh, we have to do regular. Okay. Hmm. Like what? Got like missiles here. Oh, okay, so these little, little thing. Hmm, okay. That's what I was missing. Hopefully they got a, like a little refill spot. Do these things come back, though, after you take them out? Debating on getting Resident Evil 8. Wasn't sure how I felt about the first person shoot review. Gotcha. Much better than 7. Not sure on that one. Um, oh shoot, see, like I'm out of like missiles now. There's one right now. What the heck? I st oh man. Look for a third, third person view. I know, me too. PlayStation's still one of the best games of all time. <laughs> Jazzavar. Oh, cool! It does look like uh, it's set. 
So, okay. Alright. Now that we open the things up, now I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna save, but then I'm gonna go back to the other spot and fill up on everything. Do not a person view a lot more. I know. What's what's your favorite Resident Evil game there, Tybalt? Is it, uh, was it uh, Resident Evil uh, 2? Oh, the missiles. Oh, yeah, 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 definitely. That, that was my whole entire thing there, Jazz, where I'm like, if they don't replenish, I'm going back. Plus, I'm used to that compared to the first person view. I know, right? Exactly. I would say my favorites are Resident Evil 2, in, in this particular order, Resident Evil 2, um, Resident Evil, um, and then I would say, um, Code Veronica, um, and, yeah, I think that those are my favorite. And then maybe Resident Evil Zero after that, they're my favorite, followed by one, then Code Veronica. Yeah, that's my top three, exactly. Not like the uh, move to first person view. I know, I understand probably why they did it to get probably more people into it, but. Called it uh, R2, but yeah, Resident Evil 2, my favorite, still one of my favorite games of all time. Those, I know, right? Oh my gosh. Right there, Tyball? Oh my gosh, I love it. You can, I think it was, what was it? Jazzavar and Recon both came in on my Resident Evil 2 playthroughs, right? That's how they found the channel. Like my uh, my Resident Evil buddies, um, and I love it. I love. I mean, I grew up playing the first and second one, you know, so many so many times growing up. I probably played them a dozen times growing up. I loved it. I would love to just like turn out the lights and kind of scare myself and stuff um, on playing those games. I still have one of the best scares. I would show you what that clip is and stuff. I used to have, oh my gosh, we used to like look so professional. I hope we still do now, but we used to have a BRB screen um, and, and a raid response screen um, that was really cool, but I've got to worry about DMCA and stuff for parts of it. I've got probably one of the best clips out of there and stuff being like scared to death from Resident Evil 2. I was like saying, um, I was saying goodnight to somebody from the stream um and they um uh, and so when i was doing that i um they uh i i wasn't paying attention and then those ha those arms those zombie arms that come out after you you know um when you're going through the hallway oh my gosh i just like i was caught off guard and just scared me so bad so oh man Resident Evil 2, Resident Evil 3, and 4, a uh, top three favorites. Okay, gotcha. Resident Evil 2 Remake. I know, right? Resident Evil favorites. Resident Evil 0, 1. Uh, Resident Evil uh, 1 Remake. Resident Evil 2, Resident Evil 2 Remake. Resident Evil 3, Code Veronica, 4, 5, 6. D and uh, Operation Raccoon City and Resident, uh, Resident Evil Relations 1. Love that reaction. Yeah, I know, right? I haven't played the remastered version of uh, 2. Now they're talking about it. I'm going to. Yeah, it is really good. Resident Evil 6, even though I think it's a bad Resident Evil game. Yeah, I know, right? Jeez, I feel like I'm losing everything here. I thought I was a fan. It's a really good game. They do it so much justice. They give it to the royal treatment. You love the original Resident Evil 2. You'll love the remake. Evil 6 is good. I like the online too. Resident Evil book series also. It was pretty good. Nice Han Solo. How you doing there, Han Solo?
Jeez. Can't wait for the for the show in July. I know, right? being careless. Only shell. Do not hold back. Go up for your shot. Oh, really? Oh, man. I'm going to try that next time. There's the next time. Ow. Oh, no. All right. Okay. No button angles. All right. Got this this time. Oh my gosh, it is. It is. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> I was like trying to do that and stuff like all the whole time with the control pad, and I'm like, oh my gosh, this is a pain. Waiting for the missus to get home, spending time with my son. Nice, and it's good, good night, man. Niece is three and about to have their first son. Oh wow, nice. Telling you from the uh, no, I know you were, but I just I didn't know about hitting like L and R and stuff on angling the attack. I was using the control pad, and I'm like, oh my gosh, this is such a pain. About to have their first son. I <laughs> press all the buttons. G Man with the host! Thank you so much for that host there, G Man. Oh, I can't do charge shots. better even just doing that gotcha nice six of your deaths could have been avoided with angled shot i know right exactly nine months uh, next saturday oh man already one of the rings and spam the missiles guy okay oh man okay all right but uh, how's it going there g-man
So it's kind of like this third block right here. Solo with the resub! Thank you so much for that uh, resub. Dodge and shoot cap. Don't stop shooting. Gotcha. Thank you there, Jazavar. Oh, man. Han Solo, seven month resub. Thank you so much there, Han Solo. That means that we're going to be spinning the wheel towards the end of stream. Going splits that bomb uh, that rolls on the ground. It uh, bounces about five times before exploding. Once it starts slowing down on the on the bouncing jump up gotcha good played fallout 76 most of the day i launched my first nuke it only took me almost three years oh my gosh thank you there recon about four or five squares of health to survive that rainbow laser attack gotcha okay a fallout in new vegas heard it was the best i know i haven't played any of the fallout games Alright. Uh, stop shooting the dodge and resume fire when you land. Okay, cool. Couldn't finish Fallout 4. Gotcha. Okay. All right. All right. So we'll we'll try dodging that other thing. And fire when you land. It was like the third block. Much better. Yeah. No, it absolutely was. Shoot, I don't think that we have enough to survive that other blast. I hit too many times. We did. Try, 
The tracking is working. Not getting any hours or points. That being on uh, team. There are no crashes. Every time I do it, it would crash. Give up the last time. Finish. I have all the abilities, Master Chief, from Halo or Samus. Oh, man. Easily. Good now. Yeah. Exactly, man. I, I love this. This surprise part here. Take walk from here. Yeah. Now it's just surviving the the exit area afterwards. the large room on the escape route. First go up to the right, drop down, stay towards the left when going upward. Copy paste that for me and stuff afterwards, dear Jasavar. Um after we get past that part just so I'll remember it. What's so satisfying? Her scream. Exactly, I know, right? Okay, come on. Gotcha. I had the Series X in stock earlier, tried to buy it. It was in my cart, said it. And it said to everyone, not just me, that it couldn't ship to the address it was selected. Really? Oh my gosh, wow. Tried for an hour. Oh my gosh, wow. Time bomb set. Escape immediately. Time to run. that in this room.
Did it. Me with Samus, or Master Chief. It would depend on the technologies better, like Star Wars, the Rebels. The plot, armor, and usually have to win. Empire has better tech. This room. Missions as a kid always stress me out. Running out of a room, it's like, like that is, is exploding. Like, exactly. Didn't save the animals. Oh well. Thank you there, Recon. Tybalt. G-Man. Oh man. Miss Lady Cap. No, no worries. No worries there, Jazza. I'm just glad we got out. I'm just glad we got out of there. Oh my gosh, could you imagine? You messed that up and then you gotta fight Mother Brain. And still, I mean, what, three attempts? Thank you there, Fritz. Operation was completed. Successfully. Oh, the larger room? No worries. It's probably one of my quickest runs, I think. Yeah, that larger room. Oh man, that was fun. Oh my gosh, we didn't even need to go into stream overtime. Oh man, G-Man with the bit donation. Thank you so much for that uh, bit donation there, G-Man. Oh man, Samuels, four years, four months, 27 days, 16 hours, two minutes, and 59 seconds old. Green is one year, 18 days. 14 hours, 58 minutes, and 7 seconds. Not have to go into overtime. I believed in you. Thank you there, D-Man and Jazavar. Oh, man. Yeah. And, man. All right. You know what? Okay. Oh, man. Keep the box. You got it. Thank you there, G-Man. I know. I was, I, was like, I was, like, so focused and stuff, too. Yes. 100 points to everybody. We completed a game. Oh man, um, geez, we still have some stream time left. Thank you there, Recon. Thank you there, friend, my friend. Um, what should we play next? Now we are, up in, from now up until vacation, we're not gonna start a new playthrough of a long game at all. We're gonna be playing some shorter games. So, and, and okay, all right, hear me out. How does everybody feel? tomorrow night for do, for doing a um a modified party stream i'm not going to do like the big old like six hour party. i mean it might be six hours it could it could but what does everybody think because i'm like pretty much cheating throughout the rest of the week and weekend um uh, what does everybody think party games tomorrow night um so no streams of rage um party party games i'll probably do one free giveaway an hour instead of the two we used to do we, we do two for the party stream um and then we're only going to do the the uh the loyalty retro game giveaway that we're already planning on doing so no gift card for tomorrow night but what does everybody think we'll also do first prize winners and stuff on any of the games they'll get a steam key too i'll still do that and we'll do the bean boozled get more uh for being the awesome mentor and guide throughout the whole adventure right Oh my gosh, what explanation point points in register. Don't think at least uh, not for me. What? About to suggest party stream since I know, don't know when you go on big. I know right there, Jazz. That's the only downfall is I'm not sure if we're going to even be streaming next Friday or not. So it's a yes for me. It is G-Man. Party games. Still have streams of Rage 2 for, I know, right? I know. It's just, I, I had to like think of like, Streams of Rage for collecting items was 55%. Oh my gosh. It's probably the lowest of collecting items. Love street. Oh, streets of <laughs> You know what, Tybalt? What we do is we call it Streams of Rage. So what we do is we play games like Streets of Rage during that stream. Like our last uh, Streams of Rage that we did was um, Turtles 4. Turtles in Time was the last one. But we do play Streets of Rage too. So, got it. 55%. I know. Look at that. 
like o only over half of this stuff that's probably like the best i had done yeah so it's mainly beat em ups also running we kind of added running guns to it too um just to expand the amount so party games would be fun perfect i i wasn't gonna say anything at the beginning of stream i was so tempted to but i was like if we were going to be playing this tomorrow night i didn't want to like say okay we're going to do party games and then you know leave this one hanging so i do like the cheesecake factory so party game sounds good awesome there tie ball one, one thing that we do that's really cool uh for the party games for the party streams and, and this this goes for and what you'll see is like a simulated version of our six hour party stream so whenever we reach that party stream goal what we do is we do um well i'll still do triple points that that won't be a problem we'll still do bean boozled we'll still do um the, uh, we'll do one free giveaway one free steam key giveaway an hour or in between the games but it kind of equates to about an hour anyway um just one instead of two um we'll still do first place winner and stuff there so and then just one of the big giveaways so need to go i think i've been uh I think I've been to the Cheesecake Factory about once ever. Oh my gosh, they have some really good ones. But we always, we play Jackbox Party Pack, their tie ball. It costs 50 grog tokens to enter in on the games, but first place winner gets a Steam Key. Second place winner gets 100 grog tokens. Third place winner gets 50. Now, if you're not sold on the on on on, on the the steam key games and you're like just strictly console and you don't want the steam keys uh you could always opt for 150 grog tokens if you win first place but we do that we play a lot of the jackbox games um there so usually a lot of like jackbox party pack for so like fibbage survive the internet quiplash um the rap battle one i forget what that what that one's called that one's always fun the the murder mystery one so it's a ton of fun you play games like streets of rage there are a lot uh or a lot of games there is there is their tie ball exactly so i mean we might be moving to the streets of rage i wanted to play off of the original card but i don't think i have streets of rage 3 i need to get a cartridge of streets of rage 3 but i've got one and two um i technically could probably play the third one is the third one on the um on the sega collection pack this the switch it's the uh super nintendo version that we were playing it on the retron so rap battle and survive the internet are your favorite we always play survive the internet and the rap battle we always do earlier on in the the night because usually by the end of the night i am like i, I don't want to say afu but <laughs> the equivalent cheesecake factory is awesome love their menu I know, right? Oh my gosh! You can you go to the Cheesecake Factory? It takes it's like watching Netflix, right? Like literally and stuff. You're like looking through all the movies. Like, what do I want to watch? That's like literally going to the Cheesecake Factory. It was amazing seeing the the beast of a menu there. I know, right? Trying to figure out what you what you want is uh, is crazy. On the stream, that all sound oh awesome there, Tybo. And you're more than welcome to join in. I mean, the more the merrier. I mean, usually most of the games are only like eight people, so they fill up sometimes pretty quick. But we're gonna start right at five, um, and then we'll play as as late as we can go. So I I think that that's good. I mean, honestly, and stuff for me, um, you know, I really like to just be able to to kind of chill. It's been kind of a busier busier kind of week vacations kind of coming up it's a three-day weekend i'm like what better time and stuff to do this i mean i may still be streaming next friday possibly um i still I, we should know the schedule by tomorrow so i might know actually when we're going to be going out of town it's just our big thing is get that pool the pool project is when we got to be back so but it's been awesome having you there ty ball definitely definitely that's to probably make uh, anything realistically. They, they must have about any ingredient. I know, right there, D man. It makes you wonder. Now, what? Now the question is: Is what are we playing for the rest of tonight's stream? Gonna head out for the night, Cap. Congrats on beating Super Metroid. Always love these streams. Looking forward to tomorrow night. Take care, Captain and crew. So uh, awesome. No problem there, Jazzabar. Thank you so much for uh, for coming on in. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We got a Scarlet Raid. We got a Scarlet Raid! Scarlet, how are you doing there, Scarlet? Long time no see, how are you doing? 
and stuff. They're Scarlet. Oh my gosh, it's a raid. Please, can I get uh, Raider Command and a shout out and stuff for Scarlet Heli and probably one of my my one of my best friends on Twitch and stuff here. Um, I have known her almost the entire time that I've been been streaming on Twitch. A fantastic person, streams so many really cool games. So talented and stuff too. Please, definitely, if you're not following Scarlet Heli, please definitely give her a follow. She's amazing. I've met, I've seen her, what, what is it, two or three times we've seen each other at TwitchCon. I mean, I, I can't, I can't even keep track. It's just always so awesome. Every time we go to TwitchCon, I got to ha hang out with, uh, with Scarlet and Kubi. And how are you doing there, uh, there, Kubi and, uh, Dope Goaty? How are you doing? So awesome to see you there, Dope Goaty. Oh man, your face, it's got a beard. I know, right? It is. This is my, like, my COVID beard. So, shock the fruit is that good with the mini that big? I know, right there, Tybalt? Oh man, and thank you there, uh, Recon, for doing the uh, Raider Command and the uh, in the shout out as well too. Oh man, but um, how is everyone doing tonight? How was your stream there, uh, Scarlet? What were you playing tonight? What, what, what were you playing? What were you playing? What are you boying? What are you selling? Oh man, and and Ball Amazing. Oh man, I love the name Ball Amazing. Welcome to the stream. Mostly cloudy with a chance of sulfur. <laughs> I love that. Oh my gosh, it's so awesome. Doing great. That is so so awesome to see you there, Scarlet. Oh man. Well, good pe and definitely there, Ty Ball. You can in every person and stuff that we we introduce people to and stuff with the raid as well too at the end of stream. I mean, I can. I mean, I I don't get a chance to check out every person that's on our team, but I know our team that we have and stuff. Digital Odyssey, and it's like a lot of the people and stuff like that are really cool too. So I could vouch for pretty much everybody that we're uh, that that we raid and stuff. And Ball, amazing! Thank you so much for that follow. Welcome to the crew. Great to see ya. Looking so good, dude. Thank you so much there, Scarlet. I, I I know I know you're you're checking everything out and stuff on the social medias, you and uh and Kubi and stuff like that too and everything, but uh I know I feel so great. I mean losing the hundred pounds is just amazing. So <laughs> I knew you when you were <laughs> were a baby bot. Don't make me pull this stream over. <laughs> Kubi, oh my gosh. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. Get I know get get a get get a beer again I know right exactly we need to doing some Saren Fate in some new games oh cool awesome 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 oh it's like Star Stardew but which really so is it kind of like almost like oh oh man what was that game the Graveyard Keeper oh man so love that cake emo I know right oh my gosh that is so cool that definitely is his cat jesus oh my gosh 100 pounds i think i found some of them oh man don't go to i know right oh my gosh i know right definitely we were actually we just finished um we just finished super metroid and we were gonna actually start um play some other random retro games since we completed it i have a vacation coming up i'm not exactly too sure when we're gonna be going and sometime it'll be could be as early as sometime next week late next week but um, so we don't want to get into another long playthrough. But after I come back from vacation, we're going to be playing through. Um, we're going to be playing through Vandal Hearts. And Toga, how are you doing there, my friend? Awesome to see you. Awesome to see you there, Toga. Actually playing Graveyard Keeper for my for my uh, born day on. Oh, are you really? Oh my gosh, it's so cool. Congrats on Super Metroid completion. Thank you so much there, Dope Goaty. It was my third playthrough. I played through the very first time on stream of it, and then I played it a second time shortly after I beat it even. I bought it on the 3DS and played it just to see if I remembered where everything was um, as well too. So this was our third time playing it, but it was still like a couple years ago. I wish uh, Scarlet a happy unbirthday. Oh man, definitely happy unbirthday there, Scarlet. Oh man. <laughs> we're, we're happy she was definitely their ball amazing oh my gosh scarlet is like such an amazing friend scarlet and kubi are pretty much like they're my twitch family they really are i probably met them almost as much as i've met um you know some of the other people and stuff like that too like um you have me at zombie which now she ended up doing a, a name change and stuff like that on twitch but amazing person as well too we were hanging out the last twitch con that they had so so cool 
<laughs> Dopey ball, stop! And getting a, a, a rescue senior dog and cat. Se oh, cool! Been through a bunch, haven't we? I know, right there, Scarlet? Exactly. I know, part, party on the chat. Haven't seen Vandal Hearts in so long. Used to watch my dad play it when I was like, oh, really there, Toga? Oh, man. Then you were, you were going to be in for a treat. It is so much fun. I love it. I, and you know what? It also and stuff too. You know what? With that raid, we're gonna also spin the wheel here. But you know what? I I got something for um, for Scarlet here and stuff too. Let me see if I could find it. I I think I saw it the other, um, I think earlier here and stuff. Um, I just gotta uh, make sure that uh, I know how to uh, just spell it. Let me let me see. Here we go. Let's see if anybody um. Uh, recognizes uh, this sound too. Where is it? Oh, you know what? Maybe it was one of the first ones. May have been. Let me see. Where is it? Where is it? Yeah, got something definitely here for uh for scarlet and stuff here let's see where is it where is it where is it where is that one on that that page but maybe not where'd it go i swear i i like found it and stuff like that um just uh just by itself and stuff before i saw it and now i can't even find it it's not that one. Where is it? I'll catch up a chat as soon as I uh, as soon as I play this. That's it. Did I? Maybe I named it different. Something different. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Let me let me make sure. Here we here we go. <laughs> and then of course we got one for uh for for Kubi as well too. <laughs> oh man that's so funny i i had to play it oh man let me let me see I, I, you had me a zombie it's a it it, 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 it definitely really want to see some mad genius port hollow knight stuff to the at super and, and nintendo imagine an ost in 16-bit form i know right there dope oh my gosh i know what you're doing <laughs> sir golden sun battle music Oh, I know, right, Dope? I played it for the first time and stuff on stream. Scarlet was telling me all about it. I never even knew what Golden Sun was. Scarlet introduced me to that game, and oh my gosh, it was so much fun. It was so cool. I would totally play it. <laughs> the Golden Sun games, you really want an analog pocket to play them? Yeah. Oh, man. It's such a good one. It really is. You are welcome there, Scarlet. You are welcome. Uh, we got to figure out what we're going to play next because we still we still got a little bit a uh, little bit longer. We'll we'll, we'll go um, we'll go a little bit a uh, little bit more and stuff too. I mean, we've always gone until eight. Oh, perfect timing. Free giveaway there too. Oh man, so free everybody. Explanation point booty. Oh, there we go. Gonna leave, put it back on the game, but we're done with the game. Uh, let's see. What should we put on? What should we? What should we play? What, what are you playing? Uh, let's see. What do we want to play? That's kind of like a good one-off game. A <laughs> gamer. Oh, here we go. I'll, I'll I'll play this one and stuff for uh for gamer here for you. Wretched slugs! Don't any of you have the guts to play for blood? I'm your huckleberry. <laughs> oh man, I love that sound effect. 
since we're doing sound effects oh my gosh what should we what should we play through we play through or at least attempt to play through yeah wretched slugs exactly exactly the wretched slugs oh man gamer with the bit donation hey did you want your uh your sunset riders their gamer i'm your huckleberry I know I love that. I almost watched that movie last night. Um, I was almost going to, um, but I kind of wanted something that I hadn't seen like in a long, long, long time and stuff too. And I think I saw more Tombstone kind of more recently, so I watched Superman three. Let's do it. Of the 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 money tombs the movie too. I know right there, T ball, uh, tie ball, definitely. Oh, you know what? Maybe. Here it is. Switching out the Super Metroid. And we got Sunset Riders. Reminds me, anyone watch the Disaster Artist? The asset. Really, I don't think I have. But on Netflix, playing paintball once, was running another player down, yelled at him, I'm your huck. <laughs> that is so hilarious. That is great. Been watching Dark Side of the Ring. If you're into, uh, big into wrestling, that show's awesome. That's that that sounds really cool. Um Never saw the the room. Famously bad real movie that Disaster Artist is about making of. It's uh, funny so far, like halfway through. Nice. Uh, man, okay. Oh, it's on Hulu. You know what? Let me, I'm not leaving the room, but I'm going to mention, let's see, mention some of the, the games that we could uh, put in and play. Adventures in the Magic. Batman, Bugs Bunny's Castle, Ducktail. I think we played that one. Right? Bester's Quest. Little Mermaid. Aid. Um, I don't think I've beaten it. Uh, Nightmare on Elm Street. It's here. Top Gun, Who Frame Roger Rabbit, Billows Along, No Noid, This is an awesome stream setup. Is it? Thank you there, Ball Amazing. What's on your list? Monkey Island? Oh man. Yeah, I don't have Monkey Island and stuff set up. Nightmare on Elm Street, some good old classic LJN bombs, I know, right? Or, um...